a young dad is still coming to grips with a case of road rage that put his kids' lives in danger. It happened just after 8 this morning on Snapfinger Woods near Wesley Chapel Road in DeKalb County. He says that a gunman opened fire with his young children inside the car. Fox 5 reporter Christopher King is live there right now. Christopher, just an unbelievable story. Tom, Christine, it's absolutely terrifying. Now, just imagine you're driving in your car with your kids. You're talking to your kids. Another car pulls up and a guy starts shooting. It was a nightmare. You don't, you don't want to live that. You don't want to shoot. You don't want to be in a gunfire. This young dad is still shaken up. How do you explain this to your children? I don't. I don't know how. I don't know how. He struggles to explain a case of road rage that put the lives of his young kids in danger. They're still scared. Now they... I'm sorry. I'm sorry. He asks Fox 5 not to identify him. He tells us he was driving along Snapfinger Woods near Wesley Chapel around 8 this morning when a dark colored Honda cut him off. A car swerved in front of me. The dad kept driving. Then he says the guy in the Honda stopped and pulled out a gun. Oh, he fired a shot, and I got my kids in the car. His son, just 10 years old. His daughter, just three. She heard gunfire, and she didn't understand why. He says the gunman fired at least five shots. So I tried to just get away. The terrifying ordeal ends on the on-ramp to I-20. His son and daughter still traumatized. This is something they're going to have to live with and, and, and deal with for a long time. My daughter stayed down 20 minutes after, stayed down in our car seat. Like, even after the situation, not wanting to get up. Absolutely incredible. Now, DeKalb police say they have no record of this incident. That dad says he's waiting for DeKalb police to get back to him so he can file an official report. We are live in DeKalb County. Christopher King, Fox 5 News. Oh, just so scary for that dad. Christopher, thanks.